Hello guys, it's me, Costa Crafter One, and with another trip to Universal Studios, Hollywood, Florida. I'm used to Florida. But anyways, um, I have another day. I'm making the must out of my season pass. The park closes at 10 today, as May the 30th, 2022. So, yeah. So I'll be going in on the red carpet. So, so, all right. Let's see how the day is going. I'm gonna ride the Transformers, which it's my favorite ride of the park. So, yeah. And hopefully the Simpsons ride. It's like I love the Simpsons area. I'm gonna take advantage of the section. So I'm gonna hit it on the popular rides first before the queue line gets higher or. I had to go on the single riders and I have a family going in with me. But yeah. All right. I hope I recorded sideways, but because remember that I have an input lag on my phone and remember last time it was recorded very article. And it's, it's a lot of problems like that and I, had trouble editing it so I had to put a description on YouTube of my other video about this type of issue. Oh being bumped or someone sorry. Alright. Here we go. The movie studio. So there it is. Um yeah, I'm vlogging, so stay away from here. All right. Yeah, I have to social distance for also safety, even though I'm not wearing a mask. But I still do adhere that I have to social distance. Anyways, here I am to the main street of the park. And they have the Super Nintendo World in the shops right here. All right, the cast members. <laughs> All right. I like sushi or no, no, it's not sushi. I did not bring my cup because I'm going to drink water this time. But I'm going to save up for a Starbucks coffee or something instead. So. Yeah, it's very crowded today because this is Memorial Day 2022. Oh, there she is. There's Marilyn Monroe. I'm gonna hold on to this. So, I think today we're gonna head on to the Water World. I hadn't gone there for like almost a year, so, so I'm gonna have to see what time the show starts. And I'll probably be filming. Like a 12.15 they said, so... We'll probably go to the DreamWorks Theater. At least because I want to try and warm up my thrills. Yes, yeah, so I want to warm up my thrills and um... And I'll be going to the Kung Fu Adventure, which I wish Shrek was still here. But unfortunately, that's we got that. Oh, I see park maps here. Let's see if I could grab a park map if they have it. Universal Express. It's like a fast pass of Universal. So I don't know if I. I think I see some pamphlets. Now I don't see any park maps to keep home. That is unfortunate. But oh well, I already know my way in the park because I've been here almost a year, so. We're gonna hit on the Kung Fu Panda, let's see, so. Oh, so right, we're heading out to the DreamWorks Theater. The theater, and um. I'm only recording the pre-show because I, my phone is precious and I needed to vlog all day. 
so and also they don't let me record on rides so unless I'm trained it's about to start so the pre-show I could only record that then so my phone is pushing The song is copyrighted, so it may not be monetized. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the DreamWorks Theater. It's showtime. Oh, the trolls. I hate to break it to you, but we're doing a Kung Fu Panda show. Says who? Says everybody here. I prefer the Shrek show because I'm the Shrek for you. Front, and maybe that family over there. <laughs> They're obviously Kung Fu fans. Look! I'm not a Kung Fu Panda fan. I know, but I see you further around and raise you one talking donkey. Wait, look at this. The Sword of Heroes. Oh, aren't we hoity toity fancy fancy? And the coolest thing of all. The Ming Hammer. A relic so powerful, it knocked you into the spirit realm. Check these. I can't come in with that. Hold it, hold it. Oh, you've just received a message from the Emperor. Ooh, my clever son has been asked to make a special delivery for the Emperor. How do you know that? Simple. I read his mail. Is that the delivery? Oh, that looks important. It's more than important. This is the liquid of ultimate power. Well, if the Emperor needs that delivery, then we'll make sure he gets it. Right, guys? <laughs> but we may not all survive. Okay, look at that. That's the message, right? <laughs> she said duty! Oh. Sorry, guys. I think we may need some warriors that are a little, um, bigger. Aww. Wait, I know something fun. Let's have a tea party. You guys come as backup. <laughs> I go for strikers. <laughs> this is gonna be great. Meet you inside. <laughs> Sorry, guys, my video cut off. So. Come on! Who shouldn't change his mind? I heard that. Just kidding! <laughs> hey, buddy, can you give us a hand in these doors? <laughs> Unfortunately, my backpack tore, so I'm gonna hold it like a guitar strap. Hopefully, it doesn't tear the rest because I won't be able to vlog without it. So, but you know, I only carry water, <coughs> so I could just get myself a soda or something. And all right, and we are in my favorite one of my favorite areas. But I will be back for a little moment because I want to ride the Jurassic ride, I guess. All right, now back. I'm, yeah, we're gonna go down the lower lot, which is by the Simpsons radar section. So my dad is actually we're gonna probably ride the Minions or something. But my dad is digging. So over there is the the lower lot. And the last time I recorded um, the Simpsons um, section, I felt like I got a copyright claim on YouTube. So I'm gonna like either edit out the audio so you may not hear me talk. So I will probably.
So I'm going to talk over it very loud. So if people think I'm saying very loud stuff, excuse me. That's to avoid copyright claims from YouTube. So, and I'm filming this blog for YouTube. <laughs> so anyways, um, this is the crusty Burger, like the McDonald's of the Simpsons universe. We're going to head down to the lower lot before we do something here. Unfortunately, or apparently, I will not be eating there because I know how expensive the food gets and I don't have a cup. So, it's copyrighted by Disney, the music, so that's why I'm going to talk over it before the YouTube algorithm um, tends to get copyright claim. If it did, then it's, I'm just going to upload the video for fun. You know, not for monetary reasons. You know, like I'm recording it just to keep some memories. So, I'm gonna, I wanna write this before something happens to the Simpsons land. Hopefully they keep it forever. Oh yeah, they brought back the, cause the last time when I was here, they didn't have the, the vibrator. So, I'll be cutting off vlogs, I'll be writing the Simpsons right. I'm gonna be writing the Simpsons. And one of my favorite rides, but I prefer the Transformers anyways. But this is my favorite area, Universal, so. Look at that. Yeah, this is, um, uh, what they think, I forget his name, but. Willie, yeah, thank you. Yeah, because I don't talk about him. It's, he's the janitor of the Springfield Elementary School. And this guy is like the random old guy there from The Simpsons. And this is the signage right here. Crusty tribute to the great theme park lines. Wow, 45 minutes. It's gonna be a good of a ride. I, it's a pretty good ride, so I recommend riding this if you are Universal while you can. In case I ever close. Wow. Hey, hey, it's me, Crusty. Congratulations, the line's almost over. Only 45 more minutes. What? Just I'm telling you. I have no idea how much longer it is. So here to entertain you. Itchy and scratchy. Yeah. Hey, wasn't just too drunk. She just out of the gutter. That's a lie. And yet they're You're drinking fired. it. Leave the suit. All right, keep the suit. Damn. This is what you carry. This is what you carry. That may mar your otherwise enjoyable day at my park. There's a psychopathic killer on the loose. His name is Sideshow Bob, and he used to work for me. For some reason, he hates me. And he wants to kill Bart, too. <laughs> then Bob tried to frame me for robbery, and he was foiled by the Simpsons. And now he's vowed to kill them all, even the baby. Six months Bart, ago, that's funny. Bob escaped from the Springfield Penitentiary. Like a 20 ounce stroke! 
We're heading to my favorite ride of all the park, the Transformers ride. All right. So yeah, this is like my favorite section of the park is the lower lot as well as the Simpsons section. So. I'll just record the scenery as I go down the escalator. I'm recording. Yeah, he's just talking about personal stuff and I don't like it, so. It's a nice scenery. I have to move away from the railing. Anyways, huh? My dad's over there. You gotta catch up. So. Cause I always do it like this. So. And yeah, an update of the Nintendo Land. It's almost complete, you guys. So let me get on this escalator. You see right here. 
in 2023 that uh, the, the section will open. It's gonna come with Mario Kart the ride. It's on the, you know, the video games? The Mario Kart's like one popular game on the Nintendo. Like starting with the Super Nintendo, N64, GameCube, which is Double Dash. And then we have, well, the Wii, Mario Kart Wii, then DS, DS, 3DS, Wii U, and now the Switch, which is a very popular game on every platform except the original Nintendo. There's the Mummy Ride. The best ride is right behind it. The Transformers. I'm going there early before we go eat, so. So the song may be copyrighted, so I'm just uploading it for fun, unfortunately. So. So yeah, I'm recording for scenery like this. That's why I like recording like that. It's on the last and final steps. I'm gonna handle the hunger. I nearly fell on the other steps. So yeah, there's no lift up to get up there with the lift. Yeah, everything is on the escalator. Hey, June 10, I think a new Jurassic film is coming in. So. Well, the mummy ride is empty. I probably may ride it or something. Probably take the credit. So. It used to be a studio building, but now it has a roller coaster inside. Pretty small coaster. Yeah, that song is copyrighted, unfortunately, so I'm not uploading it for fun. So, so keep in mind, yeah, I'm gonna make a little statement before the video that these songs may be copyrighted, so I might get a little claim on the algorithm. See, I always put copyrighted music here. So. Oh my god, the line is empty on that ride. I know Manches. I do heavily speak Spanish. I'm a span I speak Spanish as well. So I say no matches me like no way. Alright. Wanna take a video vlog right here. Just in time for the vlog, so just in time for the video. I want to ride it though. The ride is built in 96, but it refurbished in 2016 on its 20th anniversary. It's a roller coaster. Let's go to the roller coaster. To act and sound like a T-Rex, we're going to see something interesting. You want to come up here? Yeah, come on up here. I want you to stand right in front of Juliet, right here. I want you to assume the position of a T-Rex. Yeah, look at that. Those hands come out, those jowls come out. A T-Rex has very sharp teeth, right? She's a carnivore. I want you to give me your best T-Rex scream. Now you'll see, this is her defense mechanism. She goes into what we call bulldog. She gets real low to the ground. She balances out her center of gravity, puts those horns straight up in the air for protection and defense, and she will lash out at any carnivore in the area. Now you're not a carnivore, right? You don't want to be you don't want to be impaled by a horn. Here's how we say that we mean no harm. We put our hands up like horns. We bow to her. Good job. Good job. Nice work. Thank you. Uh, you'll see that a lot in the paddocks here. The Triceratops all seem to do that to each other, and we have found that that sort of means 
Because they use these horns for protection and defense, when they put them toward the ground, that means I mean you no harm. You are no threat to me. You do not have to worry. Good job. Now, you know why we call her a Triceratops? Three horns. Okay, the dose of airtime on my mommy ride is awesome. So, I definitely love it. But it's not the greatest airtime when you find the um, Fury 325 at Carowinds. But there's some airtime in the my home park in um, Universal Hollywood. So, but yeah, I'll give you a chance. It, it, if you have the chance, you it's best to ride it. Because, um, boy, that thing is awesome. Forwards and backwards, whoa. And it's a dark ride combination. That's a full package for you uh, for if you're interested. So, yeah. I think this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. No. Best ride ever, guys. Best ride ever. Transformers. So, the Transformer ride was awesome. It's always been... And I'm already used to it, so I don't feel much thrilling as it was back in the day. If you sit in the front, it's actually better than sitting in the back I'm on the Transformers. I'm going to say that. So, yeah, if you ride the Transformers, the best experience is in the front. I don't say it in the back. Because in the back, you don't feel as much. But yeah, those visuals pretty much make me feel like I'm in the ride. Like I'm in the world of Transformers. So yeah. Back. We hope you enjoyed your time with our Velociraptor today. Your participation in the Raptor program is vital for the safety and training of our animals. We are thrilled to bring you the planet's most exciting. I want to ride the Jurassic World. You gotta wait until like uh, there's a drop. I wanna film the drop for YouTube. of this as her territory. The more you encroach on it, the more on edge she can get. When she not charges, it's not that she wants to hurt you, but she's actually getting a little nervous. All right, did we get it? Great Mom. job. We'll see you next time. Right this way, my friend. We're going to have you hang out right here. 
face that way. Now one of the reasons we can bring Blue out here today is we keep that belly of hers constantly full. Come on over. Come and hang out right here. Face that direction. When we're going to bring Blue in front of guests, we feed her once every half hour. Now the closer we get to that next feeding time, you're going to be able to tell she starts to become more vocal. It's just uh, an animatronic. She could even get a little aggressive. You ready? Can you stand right here for me? Yeah, face that way. You don't want to be in front of her when it is time for her to eat. You all can probably feel there's a little bit of a breeze in here. That breeze feels good to me and you. It's actually a bad thing for Blue. Velociraptors have very highly developed olfactory lobes. That means she's got a really good sense of smell. You ready? Come on up. Come on up. We're going to have you hang out right here. Sir, we're going to have you stand a little closer. You'd be the bigger me. Right there. That's great. Hey, okay, Sarah, after this one, let's hold for just a second, all right? Now, what that breeze is doing right now is picking up a bunch of smells she's not familiar with. Those smells are you all. Smells she potentially finds delicious. The windier it gets, Closer we have to monitor her behavior. We're going to hold that line for just a moment. Blue is starting to display some signs of agitation and aggression. When this happens, we want to take a step back, give her some space. Probably eat at the same six section. I was hungry after riding the mummy ride again. So, I'm probably getting drunk. Okay, this is my crusty burger that I ordered, $15. Just without a drink, that's why I brought this with me. So, yeah, this is a, a cheese one. It's just like a general burger. So, I'll be enjoying it. I'm in the top floor seating and just to enjoy it well. And I'm wearing them just for the vlog, guys. So, yeah, guys. So, you can never go to Universal Studios without going to the studio tour. That's what it's for. So, yeah. Like, when you go to Universal Studios, don't ever miss this. You should always write this when you before you leave the park as well. So, yeah, I'm carrying a big bag, sorry. So... Takes even longer, but because of the tram, it's a little longer today. I will not be filming the ride, unfortunately, due to it's an hour, and my phone's about to die in 30%. So, so yeah. And I'm trying to save up battery for. Um, you win a seat on the next door. Unlike this young lady. There we go. Now she's on the winning team. Oh, wow. Also, if you're standing on a star, that means you're not standing on that red line. We painted it red because we want you to not stand on it. Uh, stay on those stars. The tram will be pulling forward in just a couple of minutes. It cannot pull forward if anybody has... The queue's moving a little fast today. So, so stay behind that red line, and we'll get you going in just a couple of minutes. There I am. I look cool, huh? I look cool with the 3D glasses. All right, I'm gonna take a selfie and post it on Instagram. CSI Beyond Borders. This is Mexico as well as Spain on that show. And they even transformed this area into Peru for Indiana Jones and the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. And here's the rain. This is a sprinkler system that shoots the water straight up into the air, letting it fall naturally to the ground. And it's only in certain sections. We can have the actor stand directly under one of the sprinkler sections, and then we can adjust the camera angle to make it look like it's raining everywhere. The thunder is coming from speakers hidden in the set. The lightning is from strobe lights. You do have to be a little careful with rain, though, because too much can cause a flash flood. And keep an eye out on that left-hand side.
and a flash bulb to see the movie Big Fat Liar. And that's where they drain the water. Okay, guys, so just so you know, yeah, this is a great show. Waterworld, then, um, basically, this is gonna be my last segment of the video. If my phone is still alive by 10 p.m., then I'm gonna do a little more. So, stay tuned, do not click away from this video, okay? You may skip on the next time stop on the description and below so you don't miss. The uh, last part of the video. And this is Waterworld. All right, people, this is uh, Harry Potter World at uh, Universal Studios Hollywood. I just want to get the footage out there on my YouTube channel, so, on my videos. Just so I can have another um, footage of it on my, on my channel. Anyways, yeah. And like I said, I cannot fit on the ride, just like I said on the previous videos of on my previous trip at Universal Studios. But here it is, Harry Potter section. All right, so I'm gonna have like a little update because my phone is about to die at this point, and the park doesn't close till 10. So I'm gonna say this that I'm gonna I'm gonna flip off my camera. My phone's about to die, unfortunately. So I'm gonna say um, like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And more videos like this will be up on your channel, as well as roller coaster tycoon videos, like roller coaster simulations, Minecraft content. So stay tuned for any more content in my channel. Thank you so much for watching this video at Universal Studios. And my phone's about to die, so I'm gonna stop filming and I have to put my phone on very in, in power saving mode. Okay, hey, hi, Sam. Um, the reason I told you in this um, video I, to watch the whole video is because, you know, throughout this day that I, I'm at Universal, my phone kept on dying. But here I am at Starbucks charging my phone, recording this video, and at least, like, letting it charge by playing an emulator. Because why not? And I'll be bored just without my phone, and browsing the web could 
potentially charge my phone slower. But hey, I'm back. It's nighttime now. It's almost 9 p.m. here at Universal. And I'll be ready to go. Let's see what's up to next if you're stayed watching this video. All right. So we got to stay here for like another hour. We're going to go to the Mario shop to get myself a sneak peek of the Super Nintendo world. I didn't get to any more rides because of like roller coaster, the mummy ride kind of kind of did it too much to me. This for just today it was too much, so I got two credits on it. So yes, so we said I'm back right this time at night. I had hopes to charge my phone, so <coughs> so yeah. They're just recording the last thing, hopefully my... So... I know my video is blurry, it's because I'm on battery mode. So, please bear with it. So... Here's a Nintendo world that I need to check out, because I love Super Mario Brothers. Sorry that I have to skip on the video, it's because I have to clean my camera. So it wasn't my battery mode issue. Here it is.